Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about spectral balance. Spectral balance is a, to, uh, a term that mastering engineers use constantly. And let's just break it apart. Balance of spectrum. So balancing all the sounds that are in your mix. So that's really a big important function of a mastering engineer. And the goal of a mixing engineer is to give the mastering engineer a balanced spectral analysis, so to speak. So what is spectral balance? It's the relationship between everything, vocals, drums, guitar, bass, piano, anything that you're recording. It's the relationship to that energy with the other energies in the spectrum, so in the frequency response. So it's a relationship based on strength, amplitude, bandwidth, you know, how the uh, much energy the instrument produces at what frequency versus other frequencies and other instruments. How does each instrument sit in the mix? And you've heard this term very uh, t uh, many times used. So it's a, it's a way that engineers bring up something or decrease something in the mix and how they position it in the mix. And vocals are really critical with this because vocals are... Uh, a big component of how we connect to music uh, emotionally. So how the engineer positions the vocal in the mix will have a lot to do with uh, whether the, the vocals are uh, more involved or less involved. Um, harmonies, background vocals, a lot of this is uh, important in spectral balance. So this, the overlapping of instruments, because all instruments share common frequencies even drums. So drums go a little bit lower than most instruments, but cymbals and, and hi-hats and things like that can get in the same frequency response range as guitars and other higher frequency producing instruments. So when they overlap, we have cancellation or reinforcement occurring. So if you get too much energy at, cer at certain frequencies, and we struggled with this back in the analog days with tape, we have too much energy at a certain frequency, it saturated the tape and you couldn't hear anything. Or the other end of the spectrum is you hear too much. A big, strong kick drum overwhelms all the other instruments in the mix. So spectral balance, very important in our mixes, very important to the mastering engineer, but equally important in room sound. So when we design rooms, we have to keep this spectral balance term in place because it's important to make sure that the room can handle all the frequencies so that the mix engineer can get all the frequencies through the microphone into the recording process. And then at the other end, the mastering engineer can balance everything out. So this is why I paid special attention to our carbon and our foam technologies. And our rooms are noted for very high resolution and very smooth response curves. And the reason they're known for that, especially in the low end, is because I want to make sure you hear everything. I want to be able to sure, hear, you can hear everything in the music and not everything in the room. So that's why I paid special attention to our carbon technology and our foam technology and the rates and levels of absorption that those two technologies exhibit. They complement spectral balance. And they do a better job in the low end than anything currently in the marketplace. And I'll stand behind that with the money back guarantee. So I'm really passionate about balance and spectral balance because I want to hear everything the artist is doing when they're singing, when they're playing, and mainly what the engineer is doing when he's recording to that. So good quality sound, like we always say, is a combination of doing a lot of little things correct, but mainly in the correct sequence also. So. This is why I've spent years and years with this technology in getting these foam uh, curves, absorption curves correct and our carbon curves correct. So I hope that uh, helps define spectral balance for us and it's a very important term in both our rooms and in our recording engineering process. Thank you. Thank you for watching our videos. We really appreciate your support and if you could give us a thumbs up for our Facebook page, that would really be helpful to us. A room form uh, gives us all the information about your room, length, width, height, usage, and we need you to fill that out before you send it in. 
Those of you that just found us on the internet and are under a time crunch, you can go to the contact section of our website and there's a book now button so you can book a appointment with us, but make sure I have your uh, room form to go on with it. The ebook series that we have is free. Please subscribe to that. There's exclusive videos in there so you can get a, an idea of uh, you, your particular situation possibly with the videos. And then our forum. We have a forum on our website. There's a lot of forums out there on the internet. Our forum will, will I'll actually answer your questions and, and comments so you'll be dealing directly with me through our forum. So once again, thank you for your support.